the tomb in which the body of the Lord Jesus was laid is empty. Three days after his crucifixion, he rose from the dead. He is alive. The birth, the life, the death and the resurrection of Jesus all prove that he is exactly who he claimed to be. The Son of God, the Savior of all mankind. Almost 2,000 years have passed since Jesus rose from the dead. And he still lives today as the greatest and most powerful influence the world has ever known. If you have not already received him as your Savior and Lord, he wants to come into your life right now. He wants to forgive your sins and fill your life with his love and peace. He wants to show you a better life than you are now experiencing. A full, abundant life filled with purpose and meaning. He wants to give you his life, eternal life. Jesus says, Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any man hears my voice and opens the door, I will come in to him. To experience his love, peace, and forgiveness, and receive eternal life, you must receive him as God's sacrifice for your sins and invite him to come into your life by faith. If this is the desire of your heart, you can pray a prayer of faith, and Jesus Christ will come into your life. The following is a suggested prayer. Lord Jesus, I need you. Thank you for dying on the cross for my sins. I open the door of my life and receive you as my Savior and Lord. Take control of my life. Make me the kind of person you want me to be. Amen. If you desire to invite Christ into your life, pray this prayer silently as I say it again. Lord Jesus, I need you. Thank you for dying on the cross for my sins. I open the door of my life and receive you as my Savior and Lord. Take control of my life. Make me the kind of person you want me to be. Amen. Having prayed this prayer of faith and invited Jesus Christ to come into your life, you can be sure that he came in on the authority of God's holy inspired word, the Bible. You can also be sure that your sins are forgiven, that you are a child of God, and that you have eternal life. If you want to experience the full and abundant life which Jesus taught, talk with him every day in prayer. Discover his wonderful plan for your life by reading the scriptures daily. Claim his promises and obey his commands. Meet with others who love and follow him in the fellowship of a church. Be sure to tell others how they can receive him too. Finally, remember always his wonderful promise. I will never leave you nor forsake you. Lo, I am with you always, even to the end of the world.